Let's hear from Aaron Boone. Aaron, could you feel the dynamic shift in that dugout after Luke Voigt led things off the ninth with a home run? Um, man, I, th I thought the dynamic was all right anyway. You know, I'm, I mean, we know we're up against a tough customer in Alvarado there. Um, but, you know, guys expect it. And guys have been so good uh, in the compete department that I wasn't surprised that they'd go down fighting. But to string together the level of the bats against that guy right there was really impressive and obviously Luke a, a big shot to get it going. You mentioned the at-bats as a whole in that inning. What did you think of the job Glaber did staying alive in that situation? I mean for as good as he's been swinging lately that's probably his best at-bat of the year. I mean that's that's a grind it out, lay off some pitches, spoil some tough pitches, finally get one he could handle and, and smoked it. Really good at-bat by Glaber. Does Gio just continue to impress you out there? <laughs> yeah I mean he, he He's, he's, I mean, great at bats all night. Uh, tonight, obviously, a couple hits the other way and then absolutely scalded that ball. You know, they had him played perfectly, but he hit it so hard to, to get it over his head. Um, just, just another, you know, him coming up in a big way like he has much of the year so far. Your team is now in first place. Is it even more satisfying knowing the adversity you guys have had to overcome in this early season so far? I don't know. I mean, it's... <clears throat> Guys are playing well, and guys are I, – I love the way we're coming in every day and the way we're competing day in and day out. So I'm happy with that. You know, we're at a point in the season where it's so long to go that you don't even really get that caught up in the standings as much as, hey, we want to put our best foot forward every day. And they've consistently been able to do that. They've consistently been able to deal with whatever's been thrown their way. And, uh, you know, it's a team that comes in expecting to win. Who else? Anyone else? Dan. What did you think of uh, Sabathia tonight? I thought he was really good. Um, you know, I thought in uh, in Tampa in his last start was a was a struggle for him. He grinded through it and actually, you know, just the two runs allowed. But I thought tonight he was sharp. I thought the cutter was good. I thought he mixed in a lot of really good change up. The slider was a good pitch for him. I thought. Uh, you know, t to me, that was about as well. He's he's thrown the ball all year. I thought he was really good. Did you get a sense that he had kind of an edge to him tonight? It seemed like he was uh, fired up there a couple of times. Uh, yeah, I mean, CeCe's always got a little bit of an edge. You know, he gets between the lines. He's 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 a awesome competitor. So, um, you know, you're going up against a good club, and, um, you know, he, he went out and set the tone, I thought, really well uh, to start off this series. Coley, to the right. Uh, what went into the decision in the eighth to go with Chad Green there? Uh, we're staying away from Britain today. Um, and Chappie was only going to be in a safe situation. So even if we were tied in the ninth, we weren't going to. Um, and we just felt like that was the part of the lineup that we liked. Uh, we liked the matchup. I actually thought Greeny's stuff, again, was really good. Uh, I thought he made a mistake, you know, going down to Lau there. to That hurt him. But. Other than that, I thought he threw the ball fine. Even the ball, the the double by uh, Robertson, you know, was kind of a blocked hit over there. Um, I thought the life was there again. I just thought down in the strike zone there with two strikes to Lau um, <clears throat> was probably one, you know, w we'd like back. Meredith. You said you were staying away from Britain off day yesterday. Is there anything going on with him? Or? No, no, just, um, you know, kind of sold out with the, with the two uh, – the two outings, obviously, the other day, and you know, 30 pitches between the two. We just made the decision before the game that Britt we were going to stay away from, and Chappie we were only going to use in a safe situation. So, that was uh, that was what we went in with with that in mind.